Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Now, the title of this video is Glasgow 2018. And I'm not in Glasgow, and it's now November 2019. I just wanted to give a little bit of an introduction to this video, which I do in the video itself when I filmed the vlogs last year. I went up and stayed with my Auntie Leslie for four days, Thursday to Sunday. We did some great things the Thursday and the Friday. Saturday was Pride in Glasgow and it didn't quite go to plan. There's a rough explanation in the video itself on Pride Day. Um, they basically vastly oversold the event. It was the first time they'd moved it to a different location and it just didn't go to plan and it kind of put me on a little bit of a downer for the rest of the day and I didn't film that much for it. The whole vlog is edited. I edited it um, last week. So it's edited and ready to go. Um, you should get it, or well, it's going up the middle of November basically. Once the monthly vlogs and the Disney haul and everything are up, it's it's going to be going live. So you'll finally, well, you'll literally be about to watch it. I just wanted to explain why there might be some sharp cuts in the video where I've edited and it's quite, you know, I've, I've cut it. Because originally I did want to have it into two parts. Thursday, Friday one vlog and Saturday, Sunday the next. But it's an all-in-one vlog. So I'm going to stop rambling and I'm going to let you enjoy the video. And I really hope that you do. Um, we went to Loch Lomond and there was a little bit of footage from Pride and Auntie and me drinking, she made scones. You'll see it all in the vlog. It was, I really, really enjoyed it. I'll definitely have to do it again. So without further ado, here is my Glasgow 2019 trip. Isn't it, Ollie? Take it away. Mwah. Afternoon guys. Yes, it's afternoon time. Oh <laughs> Welcome back to my channel and not my little flat setting as always Today is currently Thursday the 12th of July and I am in Glasgow for a very long weekend from Thursday to Sunday I'm gonna be staying with my auntie again just like I did in February this time There's no family or full family anyways. My sister Amy comes up Friday. No, she doesn't she comes up Saturday So it's me and my auntie today and tomorrow Got some things planned. Well, she's got some things planned. Um, I've already gone and spent money in the Disney store because I cannot help myself. It was for a good cause, okay? I was almost completing mine and my friend Katie's Monsters University Sum Sum sets, which was a must because they weren't online anymore. So that's been done. I think what I'm going to do is split the Glasgow vlogs into two parts. So I think there's going to be like, Thursday, Friday is going to be sort of part one, Saturday, Sunday will be another part. So I think that's how it's going to go down. We'll, we'll soon see, we'll soon see. Anyways, I'm literally around the corner from where my auntie lives. So I'm going to go for now and I will check in with you all soon. The master of work making lunch. <laughs> and I think we're going to sit down under that tree. Yeah. With a glass of wine, I think. Glass. Well. Glass of wine. Lunch is served, that saved me. <laughs> wow. We're just cat watching. She's hiding in that bush. <laughs> So we've just had lunch out in the garden. We sat at this little table right here. Annie Liza's getting washing in. Um, Kat's washing herself in the background. <laughs> but I'm gonna show you a little bit of the garden right now because um, my auntie basically does the whole thing. It's like a block of six flats and she's the one that looks after it all. So this here is the door you come out of into the garden and you've got, she put all this like uh, reed fence in so far along. She's got fairy lights and everything all around it. She's got all of these amazing plant pots. Haven't got a clue what any flower is. This is what's left over from the sandwich and the rosé wine. You've got all of these all along here. So this flower lights up. You've got all the hanging baskets as well. All of this. You've got this tree and this has lights on it. So hopefully you'll see it later on. At some well at some point in my stay all lit up it's um got lights all over all of these branches and then this is just another table 
and this is Muffin the Cat under the tree. made it to the top of like what have we made it to the top of like a hill <laughs> very nice <laughs> now we need to get back down the other side and then we are going to house for an art lover for probably alcohol I think it's well deserved after climbing up here and then this is the views in the background it's pretty nice This is where the port visited. The famous John Paul IV, the wee one that was caught for a long, long time. See this white wall? And this was full about 200,000 people or something, so they said. Oh, it's massive, Scottish thing. Gavin! Gavin! So we're now at the House for an Art Lover and they've got this lovely foot thing. A bench that says bench on it. Jellies! And some jellies which look a bit dirty. <laughs> yeah. Got a metal thing and then this is where we're about to go for something to drink. And maybe a cake because, you know, I'm on my holidays, I'm allowed cake. Here we are outside, art for an art lover, house for an art lover. We'll get it right eventually. We're a pure Danish, which is warm with Peroni because, you know, cakes and Peroni. <laughs> we've got wine and we've got sparkling water and you have lemon, lemon and blueberry. blueberry. Lovely. So we have just been to House for an Art Lover. You saw that we had some alcohol, some sparkling water, and we had a cake each, which was very nice. We walked back through the walled garden, which I filmed a little bit of. It was very pretty inside of there. And we are heading back to the flat now. Pop into co-op to get some messages. We're having chicken pasta for tea. And I think back down to the garden to have another couple of drinks later on. Have Prosecco, we've got some raspberries, and Auntie Leslie is gonna make chicken pasta. Oh, that was very easy. <laughs> we've got these really fancy glasses. And how many raspberries do we have? Two. Two. Two in each one. Two in each one. We're very posh up here in Glasgow. Mm -hmm. That's why we have two. So Auntie Leslie is on a roll with the food we've got. It's going to be a creamy chicken and mushroom with some rigatoni, prosecco, and there's going to be salad and garlic bread. The finished product and the chef herself. <laughs> it smells so good. Cheers. Cheers. We finished our tea and we are going to be going down to the garden to sit under the tree I think I'm not sure but she's now decided to prepare drinks to take down so that is my vodka diet iron brew because I'm incredibly Scottish I need to rinse the socks oh. I need to drink gin and this is the proper way to drink gin you need the ice cubes large so preferably for a good quality gin so today we're having Tanqueray Seville Always a double measure with Auntie Leslie. And Always. Off we go. And you just pour that in. Mm -hmm. And we're having a fresh orange as an accompaniment, a little squeeze. And then we're going to have Fever Tree Kid on, and it's light. Always Fever Tree. And then if you don't have the wee tin, it's three measures. So it's one, two, three. And there we have it, a beautiful 
G and T. And I've had my crisps before we've got downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> Give us a wave. It's like just after 10 o'clock, it's day one, and all the little pretty lights have come on. All on the fence, we've got them all on the tree. We were sitting here earlier on, but we moved over there out of the shade. And you've got all the lovely flowers, and we're gonna go upstairs, I think, because we're off on a boat trip tomorrow. Well, guys, that's it for day number one in Glasgow. Um, hopefully you've enjoyed what you saw. We didn't do overly loads today. It was kind of more of a settling in day. Um, I did visit the Disney store, but it was so super busy. Obviously, the kids are on school holidays. It was rammed. There's a Disney sale on. It was so busy. And I had to drag my suitcase around and try and not knock children out with it. So it was a bit difficult. Um, bed now. I've been made a hot chocolate and I've got a glass of water as well. Um, we just had a really nice day. We went like a walk. You've seen everything that we basically did. We had a few drinks outside in the garden, had lovely tea, um, lovely pasta. So yeah, that's been about it. Tomorrow we're doing a boat trip, which will be really cool. And going for lunch somewhere before the boat trip as well. So um, hopefully you will stick around and check that one out, although it's probably going to be attached to this anyways. So you'll see it in like like a minute or two anyways. But um, hopefully you've enjoyed day one and I will see you for day two incredibly soon. Bye guys. Good morning guys. Today is Friday. It's day two of the Glasgow series, which is going to be hopefully split into two parts. Um, today we are off to Tarbert. We're going on a boat trip, going for lunch. And the rest of the day, I have no idea. But you'll find out when I do. dinner you'll have just seen it you'll have seen like a little snippet we had macaroni and cheese we had the same thing it was very good indeed we are currently at uh, Loch Lomond we're gonna be going on there I think in that oh I'm not even gonna try point I always get it wrong so yeah we're going out for an hour it's cloudy the sun's behind the clouds the good thing is it's not rained watch me now jinx myself and be stuck in a boat for an hour in the rain but um yeah let's um see what this is going to be like because I've never done anything like this before so yeah I'm not too sure which boat it is but um the view the scenery is incredible although it's not picking it up very well in the video it is a bit misty but the sun is trying to break through those lovely grey clouds and then up behind you've literally got all those hills and everything Posh houses. <laughs> so we are about to go on one of these. Unfortunately, we don't have those blue skies, but we're doing this Northern Highlights one here. Get to go past waterfalls. Which one is, which one is it? This one. It's on the, the small one. Great. us the sun come out we finished in Tarbet which was basically the whole boat ride and we had dinner somewhere before we did the little boat ride and now we're in a place called Luss which was heading back towards Glasgow way eh? we're gonna have coffee and cake I think because it's just something you do on holiday although I don't have coffee um, but it's actually really pretty it's all these like little cottages and yeah it's just a very pretty place like their general store looks like a proper fancy shop um, which is why the sunglasses are on, so I'm not squinting at the, you know, the camera. So I'm just gonna march on and try and follow her because she's marched ahead. But yeah, it looks really pretty. But we haven't got a clue where we're going. 
We're just wandering the streets. But I'm so happy the sun came out. So we just had our little scone in there. Coat house. <laughs> Ever the big headed one, Auntie Leslie. <laughs> you can't keep me away from Primark. I'm buying this t shirt for tomorrow. I've changed my mind. I'm buying something in my hand. And I found Disney sale stuff. And also the new Disney light, the. Um, Mickey lamp, which I will show you all. Got a lot more than my store, as does every other store. So I'll show you. There's mountains of chip bubble mugs. You've got the Beauty and the Beast bed in. And then you've got loads of Cogsworths. And then I love these sets of um, mugs. They're really cute. You've got so much Aladdin in the sale. The Genie Money Box is a fiver. The frame, two pound. In the reframe, the coasters is all reduced, all of this is reduced. I mean, it's just amazing. You've got the throws, I really want the Mickey and Minnie throw, it's got Mickey and Minnie heads all over it. Chip throw, aerial throw, I will buy the Mickey and Minnie one. It's just not the weather for it, I'm hoping that they'll still be in stock for a while. Not as much round this side, but you've got like the wee thumper thing. Harry Potter stuff, something from the reduced, more reduced but not much left. Um, we've got the wee rosy gold mirror, scary buzz, Chewbacca, he looks terrifying, cute little Mickey and Minnie mugs. And then on the back wall you've got a bucket load of Harry Potter. Ooh. So much! This looks really cool actually. And all the candles in the world. There's throws, cushions. Oh, that's a money box. Got the little photo holders. These are candles. You've got like loved ones, magic tricks. I love the cushion, like the. Ah, my t shirt just dropped. And look how amazing this light is. It's only £10. So we are back at the flat. Well, actually, we're actually in the garden now. Um, and we are having drinks and nibbles because why not? Let's treat ourselves. It's Friday night after all. Little Muffin the cat's gone by. And Auntie Les is coming to wipe the table for some reason. So it's just going to be a nice chilled evening. And that is about it. I will check in with you later. This, ladies and gentlemen, is... Auntie Leslie trying to take a photo of Wee Muffin rolling around in the grass. Oh. Muffin lives oh. up above on the first floor. She's loving life right now. The noise, by the way, is the M8 just over those trees. The garden next to us has a lovely tent. Unfortunately, the wee lights haven't come on yet tonight. Got my vodka and my diet iron room. I love the butterfly glass with my rubbish paper straw. And Leslie's on the Matthias Rosé vine. Treat from me. Chin chin. <laughs> well, guys, we've had a very chilled out, relaxed day in the sun around Loch Lomond in a couple of tiny little villages. It's been so super chilled and really relaxed. It's like half ten at night right now, and we finally got food. Got cheese on toast and a baby bell. Gonna eat this, go to bed, and wake up tomorrow nice and hopefully refreshed, ready for Glasgow's Gay Pride tomorrow. Today is Pride in Glasgow. 
it's about 11-ish. We're heading out about probably closer to one now. Actually, my sister's had a bit of disruption with the trains. Um, <laughs> I'm not going to explain it. I could be here a while. But um, we got up, we had some lovely granola for breakfast with some berries, which you saw. And um, I've got supplies for a breakfast to eat before the day ahead because I have a funny feeling there might be a lot of alcohol involved. So um, follow along on this day and um, yeah, we'll see what happens and how it ends. I want some glitter here as well because I love the boob tube. Oh, I need to draw you bloody hair. Cool, cool, like we would just. Well, you better get the bloody t shirt and that off then. Sh yeah. Well, shall I wear the boob tube? Just get the boob tube on. You've got boobs, so it's called the boob tube. <laughs> Well, hey, it's fine. I've got boob talk on here. It's fine. <laughs> Hi, no swearing on the Disney Channel. I might bring my big bag. Oh, this looks slash pink bubble. Oh, it's pink. Did it herself. Did it herself. Uh -huh. Oh, the arm. Higher and out, higher and out. And Amy's in the hall on the floor. <laughs> A work in progress. <laughs> Me too. I, Cheers, guys. They're deliberating makeup. about our disaster oh. today. <laughs> disaster number one or disaster number two? Just disaster for this. Just pride disaster. Well, we're on a hill with some drinks, so can't be all bad. I'll have to explain the disaster. So basically, there's like a main arena area and they oversold it by 10,000 tickets and people who have tickets can't get in. So we're now just drinking on a hill in the park area. Cider with rhubarb. Don't even like rhubarb. <clears throat> but yeah. Do you like my parrot t shirt? <laughs> It's the morning after the night before. She doesn't want her face in, so we're not going to include it. <laughs> <laughs> and we're making, well, I say we're making, Auntie Leslie is making cheese scones. As you can see, we'll update along the way. Well, hey, they've gone really big. Cheesy scones. Mmm, smell delicious. Put them there at the cool. And a nice real dash of real butter. Well, hey, 